Hello guys, welcome back to another video of Carolina. And today we're looking at the Black Hall T-Series duty holsters. And this is gonna be the level three retention with the strap across the top. They do make it in level two without the straps and they do make it with uh, optic uh, compatibility. This one's gonna be the light bearing and this is gonna be the for the TLR uh, streamlights lights. They do have also for the SIG P320 right now. And I'm sure they'll come out with more but this is for the Glock here. Uh, the cool thing about this is gonna be the retention, very smooth, very quiet, uh, you know, retention on it, which is gonna be uh, great for fast uh, drawing and everything. And the cool thing about this, like other uh, manufacturers make, they do have the thumb uh, safety here, which deactivates the, uh, moves the strike out the way, and you still have to press the button to take out the gun and then that gives you a quick draw and everything. But the cool thing about this is, if you see right there, there's a button right here, which is cool about it because, uh, you know, as we grab our firearm, we come down with a master grip and our thumb comes right there on the button and makes it a lot quicker to draw and everything. Where the other ones, you have to push down or either push the strap out the way first and you have to, you know, push the button on to keep holding button to draw the weapon. But with this, I think it's gonna be a little bit more quicker with the master grip and be able to draw the weapon. As you see, it draws very easily, very quietly, nice retention. Again, the gun is still not gonna come out unless you press that button. And again, this is a level two. And again, they do have the, uh, I mean, this is level three. They do have the level two um, and it comes with the uh, belt attachment and everything. Um, the belt leg strap here is sold separately, which I suggest getting. Just keeps the gun nice and tight to your body and that holster doesn't can out when you're trying to draw your weapon, which in the past I had that issue and I really suggest getting a leg strap, which just keeps it nice and close and everything. But they do have a quick attachment you can put on here. This one doesn't have one, which is sold separately as well. But I really like this holster, um, you know, Black Hall have some bad reputation back in the past if you remember the surplus holsters which uh, yeah i have used those before um in the past and they just some people has a lot of uh issues out there um you know firing going off when holstering or drawing it because the trigger finger was right here beside the uh button here and when you draw you was very close to pulling the trigger sometimes they hadn't you know some incidents where uh, people have shot themselves uh, while drawing or either holstering, but either way, this eliminates that issue. You don't have no button right here. It's nice and slick and everything. Again, they do have it for the uh, optic ready with the light bearing or without any light or anything. If you like not to run any lights, they do have the option as well. Again, level two and level three retention. And this is more geared towards law enforcement, military and stuff like that. And you know, they have used this uh, in the past and the military and everything. And the cool thing about this, which I always say, I'm glad they always leave the bottom open, which if you have a thread barrel or compensator, it's gonna protrude right through it with no issues. You still be able to use the holster. You don't have to look for another one or anything of that nature. And you have the light here as well, which also uh, works if you have any debris, anything can go right through it, fall right through it, or have no issues. And again, you can do so. Uh, you have every retention adjustment here which uh out of the factory it works just fine but yeah enough talking let's do some draws with it again no magazine changes because youtube doesn't like that but we're gonna just draw from it just take a few shots with it see how well i can draw with it with no issues and give my final opinion about the black hall t-series level three holster from black hall stay tuned I'd like to thank Phoenix Ammunition for the ammo for this video. Any other ammo that they have available as far as 223 9mm and 300 blackout as well as frangible ammunition so you can safely shoot still targets at close range. So thank you to Phoenix Ammunition and check out the description down below on how to get some free shipping. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So we got a couple rounds in the magazine. We're just going to draw, take it nice and slow, see how smooth I can draw from the holster. There should be no issues again with the way it's uh, set up and everything with the, you know, the release button and everything, it should be pretty easy to, uh, you know, draw from it. But let's go ahead and shoot some rounds. Here we go.
very nice, very smooth. Just the draw and hit reholster. Very nice and smooth and quiet. Uh, and that's what they say in the website. Uh, molded, injector molded holster here. So very, very nice. All right. Oop. That was my fault there. Then, then draw the gun all the way up. <laughs> all right, here we go. Again, very nice draw, easy to reholster. All right, we out. All right, really like it. Again, with your master grip, when you come down, you right there at the button and again you'll be able to draw your weapon very nice and easily uh, again practice makes perfect yeah all right let's continue shooting Right, guys what i think about the block hawk t-series duty holster whatever you want to call it battle holster anyways the level three really like it very easy to manipulate as far as holstering and drawing from it very quiet again very easy again as long as you come down with your master grip you have the capability to draw the firearm very quickly again with practice you could definitely make some quick draws from your holster here and I think it's gonna be very nice. Again, really recommend getting the leg strap again. Just keeps everything nice and close to your body. Doesn't move, doesn't uh, jump around anything. The holster doesn't uh, move or anything. And just the draw is very nice and smooth. Really like these holsters. Again, they have come out with some new ones. Again, with the optic ready. This is like compatible, which is the TLR. Um, Streamline TLR1, HL, which I have here, pretty much any TLR. They do have TLR7, if I'm not mistaken, but they do have it for the Glock and the SIG P320. I'm sure they'll come out with more different other ones, hopefully. But again, you have some other options out there for any kind of holsters. Again, uh, they do have the level two and level three retention for uh, the T-Series, again, with the Liberian and RMR. All right, guys, let me know what you think about the Black Hawk T-Series holster, level three duty holster here from Black Hawk. Again, I appreciate those guys for sending the holster. Really like it, definitely gonna continue to use. Again, there's so many holsters out there that everybody likes, but let me know, comment down below, what is your favorite holster manufacturer as far as level three duty holsters? or any level two in that nature. And let me know what you think about this one. If you do have one, how you like it, or have you even tried any of the new T-Series, which I think I really like it. This is my first T-Series holster. Again, in the past, the only holster I ever tried was the Serpa, which are horrible, but they have come out with new 
uh, more improved holsters for law enforcement, military, whatever it may be, security, whatever it may be. They have many options available as far as attachment, uh, quick detachment capability, leg strap. Um, they do have pretty much everything you need for your uh, whatever needs may be. All right, guys, that's pretty much it as usual. You know, follow me on social media. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. That's why I usually post any upcoming videos or products that I'm reviewing, like this one here. There is a like button. Uh, not like but join button and a membership button or thanks button whatever you want to call it so many options to help uh support channels like me small small channels and again i appreciate everybody that has been sticking around for many years now doing this and i just enjoy doing this i'm just a regular honest regular person that love uh stuff like this you know uh in a two-way community I really like everybody that has come along and met throughout the years. I met a lot of friends and I hope to continue to grow the way we are right now. But anyways, make sure to hit like, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Subscribe, like, share, all that good stuff. You know what to do. You know how this works. So as usual, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.